hey guys uh welcome to this video and as you know google just released this brand new tool and it's called the google web designer so basically uh, it's a html5 software for your desktop that allows you to create interactive web-based media uh, which includes you know you must have seen those flash like banners on various website and even advanced html5 3d animations so i have never used this i just downloaded it and i thought i am going to make a video uh for the so that you can uh, i mean listen to my experience uh when i use it for the first time so let's get started as you see i have here is a uh, new file uh, i need to create a new file here so let me just add a file name testing I mean, it's just temporary, right? So animation mode quick, uh, maybe there's advanced animation because animation is how we are going to control the movement of the stuff. So dimensions 300 by 250 is fine uh, and environment double click studio. Okay, let's just go ahead and click on OK so that I can actually, okay, uh, look at the interface. And as you can see in this interface, it looks a lot like Photoshop. I mean, if you guys used Photoshop, it at the first glance it looks almost exactly like Photoshop if, if you view it from a distance you can't even make out the difference properly so what I'm gonna do is now create maybe a rectangle and uh, start working with it uh, we, or maybe just change the background color itself on the properties uh, you see uh, as I'm using it for the first time I'm instantly familiar with where is what because I'm using my Photoshop skills so out here let me just change the color to something bright uh, just for this video's sake and uh, okay i think you can even add gradients yep you can add gradients uh, and uh, let me just add a weird kind of a gradient out here uh, that looks uh, great and f uh, that you know feels good too i'm just testing it out so let's make this a radial gradient okay so at the bottom as you can see is a timeline this is actually used for playing the animations during the advertisement this can be one second two second five second now I have selected simple animation mode but if I go on to advanced animation mode I can go ahead and view all the stuff so I'm just going to quickly add a text uh, out here in a text box and I'm going to type it as price and fees or my name actually and uh, just make the text a little bit bigger and I'm going to complete this video by showing you how to animate using the new Google web designer so let's make this 30 uh, very big and let's just make it sent uh, centered uh, guys as I'm using it for the first time I just want to tell you that web designer right now I mean after using for two three minutes it feels very easy uh, uh very simple uh, there is nothing as complicated as uh, as i was expecting with an html5 editor last but not least let me add a box out here uh, maybe color it in you know dark red or something okay that should do it uh, this is just a test i'm just going to test how the animation works okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to create no another frame out here so I'm gonna take this out I'm gonna take this out uh, I'm sorry in this frame I have to the f first frame I have to take all of this out right in the second frame I have to take all of this in and uh, you know that's it and uh, in the third frame what happens is I just take all of this out here so these are the three frames I just created so what I'm going to do is go to the first frame and just play it and see how it looks or maybe preview it uh, preview it in Chrome as you can see it just comes and goes uh, so that's it and uh, let's just play it one more time as you can see it just comes and goes and uh, that's so easy i mean all the hassle of going into flash and doing keyframe by keyframe animation for those who are not experienced this is the best software uh, for you just go download this software start animating do your ads publish them and as you can see you have this code view out here as well so it gives you the code just in case you need the raw html code and you have a button that says publish and you just publish it as a rich media and you're all done 
uh, it's so easy uh, I'll start exploring all the other stuff like this 360 degree gallery I don't know how to work with it uh, I think uh, you got to add the images and stuff and then there's this pen tool uh, pen tool is uh, pretty fam familiar with those using Photoshop again uh, you can create customized shapes uh, so this is Google Web Designer and uh, I highly recommend that you start downloading it. I'll add a link to Web Designer below in the description box and uh, please comment and let me know uh, how you're going to use it, whether it's helpful to you. If you're getting stuck anywhere, please uh, let me know if I can help and I, I'm going to use it right now for an hour or two. So I, I'm going to use all the features. I can't do that in a video because it would be utter boring, but uh, you can definitely ask me questions in the comment section below. Th that's it for watching this video. Please subscribe to the channel and uh, catch you guys very soon. Thanks and have a nice day.